pizza. What am I doing? Makeup? She's always on my shoulder. It's funny to watch. Ugh. Look at this. She's always curious what I'm doing. On pizza. What are you doing over here? When I'm cooking, she's around on the counter. She jumps to the thing. In general, she likes to do things with me. She's not a bird who busy with her pigeon stuff by herself. That's your weed. I take a shower, she's gonna always sit in the bathroom. She would eat with me. When I want to take a nap, she sits on my head on a pillow. She would sleep with me. I know she loves me because she's everywhere, wherever I go. I have been licensed to help birds for seven years and I rescued sick or injured bird. As soon as the birds recover, I release them back to the street. But Anfisa was rescued by one lady. She raised it and a couple months after she couldn't release because she was already friendly and she would just follow her. When I got Anfisa, I was planning actually send her to the aviary with other birds where she could live. But very soon I realized she's actually not interested to be around pigeons at all. Oh my gosh. Hey pigeon. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? I don't think she considers herself as a pigeon. So I decided to keep her with me. When you say hi? When I decided to introduce my boyfriend Jacob to Anfisa, she was so suspicious. Anfisa. The first five minutes, so she was challenging him. Anfisa, you jealous. Then she completely fell in love with him. Is it? You build him a nest? Now her partner is Jacob. And is helping you out? Yeah. Even when she lay eggs, she lay eggs next to his pillow. I love it, you know? My priority is gonna be always my animal. He knows that and he likes it. So we married two months after. I decided to introduce Jacob to Anfisa. When you find the right person, you know right away. You feel it. We're pretty happy to be our family. Look. You wanna say hello?